our tale of the tape for this featherweight fight. All right, now for the official introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the former UFC featherweight champion, Al Jermaine Punkmaster Sterling. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Mozart Evoya. You ready? You ready? Good. All right, so here's Al Jermaine Sterling. Hasn't necessarily been a fast starter in the UFC. There's no denying the toughness, the creativeness, his scrambling ability. You know about the wrestling acumen, but he uses his length very well. This is a hard guy to hit, and it looks like he'll be hard to hit here out of the shoot tonight. Sterling gets caught by the straight punch. Oh, a huge inside leg kick for him. Well, DC, they say styles make fights. We haven't had much of a fight here for the first minute. Hasn't been to this point. I mean, I don't have much to say, and I always got something to say. Oh, and he moves into half guard. The guard pass is starting to pile up. Right away, he takes the far side under him. Look for damage from the top to come down. All right, dominant position here. He's got the full mount. A lot of different ways he can go here. Maybe try to find an arm bar, or just get the ground and pound. He can't attack submissions, but those submissions will put... Oh! Well, no surprise there as he lets his opponent stand back up. He's going to get team. counter to the guillotine there. Get side mount, and now maybe the final choke will be there. Oh, he escapes! He got out! I mean, wow, that is great submission defense. Oh, high-level stuff here with the ground and pound by Sterling. Mm, that was nice. Oh, good defense, yes. Under a minute now to go on the round. All right, so that opened up a cut around his eye area. He hasn't moved his head well. He was taking shots too clean, and now a cut has opened up. Well, working pretty effectively from the top here. Nice ground and pound by Sturt. These ground strikes are starting to add up. North-south position, crowd just can't help itself but the left. Five minutes in the books. Hey, stop. All right, so the fighter heads back to the stool, and man, that is a severe cut Take that he's seat. dealing with. We'll Please see relax. if they call we'll in the ringside physician. We expected a bloody fight. We knew this was going to happen. We expected that war. Refocus. All right, so as the cut man gets to work, we'll re-rack some replays from the previous round. Well, he's got some work to do. The cut man's going to have to work a miracle because this guy was on the receiving end of some real damaging shots. And if he doesn't do something different defensively, it's going to get worse. And if it gets worse, the fight may be stopped. You ready to fight? Ready. Four. All right, here we go with round two. lands and he's got him hurt very bad. Right hook to the head, brothers. Right. Oh, he jumped guillotine right away. Oh, that killy is tight. Oh, come on, I'd be tapped. 
and that's got to be it. Oh, yeah, he's out. Out. oh, he got up. He did a great job. He attacked the lock. He got pressure forward, then off to the side, rolled to his back to release that pressure. While wow, he is landing time and time and time. in this man's career. A huge finish in front of a capacity crowd. After party's gonna be on fire. How about it? I mean, I'm just sitting here stunned because to watch a young athlete have a performance like this was really amazing. The finishing instincts, his ability to close the show, it was next level. It was amazing, John. The official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 1 minute, 38 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by TKO, Aljamain Punkmaster Sterling. Well, Ray Longo clearly enjoyed that result. Aljamain Sterling by TKO. And in a kickboxing match, this is a guy who can realize a lot of success. We talk about the grappling, but this man is the total package. He's the total package, John. He's long. He's big. He can fight anyone anywhere. And it showed tonight in this TKO victory.